ready to go? Uh, yeah, I'm ready. I want to know how, how much did you pay these guys to get this money? I'm, I'm waiting. You don't know. Maybe I competed last year. Oh, you don't what, know that. Okay, well, we're going to find out because I have all kinds of questions for you. And these guys, too. We have Jake Reardon McSully, Director of Rec and Wellness with the City of Fishers, along with Mr. John Wade. He is a certified running coach and Geist Half Marathon Ambassador. Yeah, and it's know. coming up this uh, September. Yeah, September. Is that right here, Jake? I believe it is. That's right. And, and you switched from spring to fall, didn't you? So. We did. That's the big news. September. 16th, about okay. six weeks from yeah, today. Plenty of time to still train <laughs> and register. Uh, but yeah, the big change, we think there's favorable conditions with weather, uh, family schedules, even construction schedules. So sure. give a lot of thought to it, but we're really excited for September 16th this year. Okay. I always wonder too, because running can be a little intimidating, right, for people. I know you said you did the mini. Yeah, and the monumental too. Oh, well, you know, the monumental too. <laughs> Any, okay, let, let's go with guys, tips and tricks, right, for running. Like, even if we're a non runner, but we can kind of get started and get into this, right? Well, what do you guys have for us? Where do we begin? Yeah, so I think the most important thing for a new runner or, or a non runner is uh, just to get out there. Yeah. Get out there and enjoy some miles, get started. Just move. Uh, yeah, you know, um, I think it's important to make sure that you've got some of the right gear to get started. Um, it's been really helpful to hit up a local running store mm -hmm. and go have have them check out your feet, get a gait analysis. They'll put you on a treadmill. Oh. You know, find the right shoes oh. for you, especially for like long distances. Yeah, we talked about that with shoes. And you, uh -huh. you have something in mind when it comes to the best shoe for long distance running? You know, everybody's different, so they're going to find something that works for them. Yeah. I, what works for me may not work for the next. Well, because person. everyone does have a particular preference, right? Like, oh, well, I like absolutely. the feel of this shoe, and you're like, oh, that's okay, but I like this one better. Yeah, I found yeah. my, uh, I won't say what it is, a special brand though, but I've been using it for years. Well, not the same pair of shoes, but the same kind of shoes. <laughs> that here. totally sounds like you to use I, I the same so. pair of I've shoes. I've had the same shoes for five years now, <laughs> but, um, no, but you know, everybody's different. You have to find the one that works for you. Yeah, so. for sure. And also with the race coming up, this is a half marathon and a 5K to its ball. That's correct. Yeah, family friendly. Everyone's welcome. All paces, all abilities. Uh, strollers even welcome in oh, our nice. 5K. Oh. Uh, we hope families can come out together, and uh, these gentlemen are sporting our medals. Every I finisher see, these are nice. gets a. Uh, look at that button. Don't touch. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's our half marathon medal, and then the spinner. Uh, is the centerpiece of our 5K there, so that's, that's kind of fun. Very nice. Go. And then everybody gets a shirt as well. So there's a super soft yeah. uh, tee for the 5K mm -hmm. and a long sleeve tech shirt for the half marathon. Is, is it, can you walk it too, or do you of have course. to? Of okay. course. Yes. I feel like that. I do it however you can get it done, right? Just whatever get, get works her done. for you. Just get, get her done. done. I get her but also, done. stretches, though. Let's talk stretches before, because, I mean. I never yeah. stretch. Well, you have to I stretch. Never you stretch. never stretch? When I go work out. All right, guys, take care of this guy. What do you need to be doing? I'm a I'm 67. I just go in and do it here. So but, I, I very seldom stretch. I don't. I just get on. I've been working all day long, so yeah. I'm already loosened up. But I know it's important. It is important. It's yeah. important to yes. stretch because you could yeah. cause some damage yeah. if you don't. Maybe that's why you keep pulling my hammy. You know. Oh yeah. <laughs> See, maybe why. But can you guys show us a thing or two? Yeah. Well, and I think what's important too is, um, especially for new runners, that's what we're what we've been talking yeah. about. Is uh, stretching is super important, but. Um, we can jump into things a little too quickly. So I think it's important to make stretching a part of your daily, kind of your daily yeah. ritual and focus on, you know, mobility, things like that, rather than just getting out there before a run and right. doing, going through a Any whole particular bunch of stretches. stretches or just kind of the, the basics here? Um, well, I think what's important is to stretch when you're warm. Um, yeah. For me, I like to warm up first with, you know, a short run before I do. Uh -huh. any other stretches. It's right. different for some people. Um, but opening up your hips. Open your, your hips. Up yeah, here. let's open up those hips. Open up those hips. Oh. I don't know if we've got room to do like any, any poses or anything uh, like that. I'll move over. I'll move over. You may want to go way over there. Right <laughs> uh, good quad stretches, though. I mean, and that's something you could do by yourself or with yeah. a partner, somebody's shoulder like Get in here. Oh, there you Stretch just, these just, out. Use that partner. Yeah, yeah. Well, there you go. Gotcha. There you go. Hey, real quick, did you say how many runners you're expecting and the fee to sign up? Or Yes, yeah. So we're hoping, we're right on track with registration. We're hoping to have about 3,200 total participants. Nice. Okay. Um, and actually, we're coming up on some important dates. So the event is September 16th. We do have a price increase August 18th. So if you're Ooh. interested in joining us, save some money to do it sooner than later. Okay. And we actually have a uh, promo code for Wish TV oh, viewers nice. today. Love so it. just all uppercase, all together, Wish TV will good. save you another five dollars per registration. Gotta good, good, good. There you go, Jake, John. Appreciate it. Thank you guys. Pleasure. Thank you. Thank you. Jake I, I was going to yeah. say, wow. 